And what's the next award, Goldie? The next award is for film editing. And such an important one. Editing is one of the most sensitive, indispensable parts of the business. Really, George? Oh, absolutely, Goldie. It implies the assemblage of the creative outpourings of the writer, the nuances and effluence of the director, the deeply subjective gifts of the actors, the instincts of the producer, the magic of the cinematographer. It determines the shape, the form, the thrust, and the rhythm of a motion picture. That's what editing means to me. What does it mean to you, Goldie? To me, uh, it means some guy slaps two pieces of film together and Warren Beatty gets all the close-ups. You know what we're doing, don't you? We're what? plugging the hell out of shampoo and we can't even mention the Duchess Shh, the what... careful, George. <laughs> to present the award for film editing, we have a very interesting hands-across-the-sea combination. He was memorable as a doctor in M.A.S.H., worked with Ingmar Bergman in The Touch, currently appears in I Will, I Will for Now, and has just finished shooting Harry and Walter go to New York. Elliot Gould. And along with him, we warmly welcome to the United States a star already famous in Europe and a nominee for Best Actress this year for her role in the story of Adele H., which I announce in awe she played in two complete versions, one in English and one in French, and I can do no less. So welcome, bienvenue, Miss Mademoiselle Isabelle Adjani. I'm glad to be here. And we are very happy to have you here, Isabelle. Thank you. Then, for Best Achievement in Film Editing, the nominees are... Dee Dee Allen for Dog Day Afternoon. Verna Fields for Joe's. Russell Lloyd for The Man Who Would Be King. Richard Chu, Lindsay Klingman, and Sheldon Kahn for One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. Frederick Steinkamp and Don Guidas for Three Days of the Condor. And the winner is... Indiana. 8668. Uh, uh, first, I want to say that uh, giving me this, uh, I consider a great tribute uh, to our wonderful, fabulous, talented director, Steven Spielberg. Uh, I would also like to say that being here at this time, after all these years, uh, I really have a long list of thank yous, which I won't bother you with. But I hope everybody on that list, primarily my two sons, I say thank you.